the challenge of learning history and more importantly teaching history it was driven home to me a few weeks ago by a new friend who was telling me that his goal is to make history a quote useful art unquote and I remember thinking to myself when I heard that that it essentially encapsulated everything that I have come to believe about history and its necessity for learning in my life. I know we say things like history is important because if you don't learn from it you're doomed to repeat it and then we turn around and say history always repeats itself. Well. Is that because we don't learn it, or is it because we don't understand it? This idea of history as art more than science is something that came to me in conception a few weeks ago. I was taking a course in the great historians and how they interpret history. And that was one of the things that the professor who was teaching it said, is that history is more art than science and it's it's more editorial than than it is pure chronicle you can't you can't talk about everything there's no you have to make an editorial decision in order to get your point across what you're trying to make and that's what in many ways turns it more into an art than a science because you have to have your agenda well what is my agenda and this is where the four ideas of the agenda came from are those four ideas the celebration the education the analysis or the enlightenment of of things and in doing so making those editorial choices essentially turns it into like i said an art rather than a science all of this has been weighing on me a lot over the last few weeks. Some of you have noticed I haven't been doing my show. I've been extremely busy with other people's shows. It's about the best way I can put it. Um, so outside of Dave Does History with Bill Mech Live, I haven't really been doing much, at least recording-wise. I have been doing an immense amount of studying. And part of the problem is that the more I study, the more I think well, I need to talk about that. The more I think I need to talk about that, the more it turns into this giant production as opposed to a 20 to 30 minute episode of a podcast, which as a radio guy, I know isn't going to work. Nobody's going to watch that. Nobody's going to listen to that. And so... It's a struggle in some ways to figure out what I'm going to do with this stuff. And that, I think, is what we're talking about when we talk about turning things into a useful art. How is this useful? And I think that that's probably, probably the biggest struggle I'm having right now. It's interesting stuff, don't get me wrong. It's fascinating stuff. I have been reading extensively about the fall of the Roman Republic, the, the last days of the Roman Republic when Julius Caesar uh, destroyed the Republic. And I'm not just fascinated by the parallels to today, those are, those are so obvious, it's like being hit in the head with a fish. I mean, it's just, it's, an, it's so, it's so obvious that it makes you feel like you're reading Jonathan Livingston Seagull, you know? I mean, it's there's no subtlety to it at all. It's just, it's like, hey, look, you know, it's no different than you guys today. You should learn these lessons. But how do you turn that into a useful art? How do you make that so that people actually take what is there and use it in a useful manner? There was a time when that could be done. 
In fact, and we're going to talk about this in the podcast when I record it, hopefully later today, George Washington understood that. And he took those lessons of that day and he turned them into a useful art. But it seems to me today that that is going to be a very difficult proposition for many of the same reasons that it was a difficult proposition in the last century BCE in trying to save the Roman Republic. It worked in 1778, but it didn't work in AD 43, or 45, sorry, BC 45. The question is whether or not we can make it a useful art that will work in 2020s, in the 2020s, in the second quarter of the 21st century. That's the challenge. How do you make it a useful art?